What's happening here, Doc? So for this patient, another great case with Invisalign. So he's had ortho in the past. It's been only about two to three years that he's completed it, but he had traditional ortho with brackets and wires. And he it left him in the state. So he still has his lingual bar. So he had an entire um, wire in the bottom of these teeth and these teeth that kept them in place. Um, but you could see his bite. He's edge to edge here, which means that the upper and lower teeth are hitting against each other. And it's causing a lot of wear and tension. So if I just look at it from this point of view, it's a lot of flattening where it should be nice and rounded. And same with the bottom, a lot of flattening of the teeth there as well. So what we went through with Invisalign to try to correct what wasn't corrected with traditional ortho, and it could have just had a relapse. I'm not saying this is where the, the orthodontist left it, but this is where we're trying to reach it at the end. So we're not gonna move his back molars too much because they're quite comfortable where they are, but we're gonna bring the rest of the teeth forward so that we have the front teeth sitting above these bottom teeth and it's a lot more comfortable for the patient. 